Hello campers, welcome to Connolly Outdoors. I'm super excited to be back outside in the campsite. I'm at Selkirk Provincial Park in Ontario, Canada. We're going to have an awesome time. I'm here with my son. This is our first camp together this, this particular year, but we have many, many books. Since I started this YouTube channel, him and I have gone a little bit crazy. He's also got his own uh, Liam's, Liam Connolly Nature. That's his channel. Check it out. I'll put a link in the description and you can check out my son's channel as well. And uh, him and I are out on camping adventures. We have developed and share the same passion together. So there's a real beauty in that. So what I'm going to do is I'm just going to start by setting up the tent and getting everything set up. And then uh, you know what happens after that. Step two. All right, I got my sleep system set up and it is hot in this tent. <laughs> it's very hot in here. I think I overdid it with this sleeping bag. It's a minus 12 sleeping bag and it's really hot. Might cool down at night though, so we will see. All right, so tents all set up, sleeping situation is taken care of. It's really hot in that tent, so we're gonna avoid that until it cools down a little bit tonight. Hand is still, <coughs> still bugging me a little bit, but it's healing. <laughs> it is healing up on for me, but I'm still out camping. No hand injury, you know, hand surgeries are gonna slow me down. We got firewood, we're gonna cook on the open stove or the open campfire, I should say. And we are gonna have an amazing meal shortly. But right now, we are just gonna drink some water because it is hot. Cheers, Liam. And we are just gonna relax. The 
that's the part where you like drink your beer for like 10 minutes and record the whole thing. <laughs> <laughs> yep. <laughs> so here's my setup. I got my fan hooked up to my Jackery. I got a light hooked up. And I've got a USB cable to keep this phone charged so I can film my videos and, you know, watch a movie or whatever on my phone. So I'm really happy. I love this Jackery. I'm not sponsored or anything by Jackery. I just um, saw it one time on Camping with Steve, and Steve Wallace inspired me to go and get this, and also Mav. Mav's another camper-type adventure guy that I watch, and um, those two guys, I don't think either one of them are sponsored by Jackery, but I saw them using the Jackery, and I thought, I gotta get me one of these. <laughs> All right, so my son and I are going down to the beach area down here. So I just wanted to give you guys a little show here of uh, what it looks like here. It's really, really beautiful, really beautiful. So here we are headed down to the beach. My son went ahead of me. <laughs> this guy is in incredible condition, so not like the old man. <laughs> But uh, we're gonna go down and check out this beach area. Awesome. Wow, this lake here is really beautiful. What lake is it, Liam? Lake Erie. <laughs> Very good. Well, my son and I found a little spot to uh, set up our chairs on a giant rock formation right in front of Lake Erie here. It's pretty beautiful. <laughs> what an amazing place. All right, well, we're gonna get set up and get comfy on this rock. <laughs> well, here we are on a limestone rock right in front of Lake Erie. Beautiful, beautiful spot we got here. Really enjoying the views. All right, so here we are at Lake Erie on this rock, <laughs> lime rock, I, I found out. Limestone, sorry, I found out. Limestone, very, very cool. Beautiful here. And now we are gonna go for a hike. Hung out on the beach for a little bit and now we're gonna go for a hike. We're walking to a different area of the beach, which looks like there's less people. And uh, it looks like a really, really beautiful spot. So that's where we are headed right now. Just coming into our uh, beach area that we're gonna check out here. It's <laughs> pretty awesome here. We're enjoying it. Definitely prefer the long time beach. Yeah, Long Point Beach is incredible. It's just amazing. Well, we tracked down a beautiful beach area where there is nobody. It's quiet over here. Freaking magic. So happy. We love this spot. <laughs> So we're back at the campsite. We're gonna have a couple snacks, a little bit of water, and then we're gonna go for a hike. Then we're gonna come back and get this fire started, make some food. I'm gonna have a beer. My son's gonna have his uh, one of his protein drinks or carbohydrate drinks. <laughs> Bio steel carbohydrate drinks, that's it. All right, so we're just gonna relax for a little bit and then we're gonna head out on our hike. So here we are, Wheeler Walk Trail, and we're going to walk this trail. Check it out, should be a lot of fun.
press 0.5 on the thing. Press 0.5. There you go. Really beautiful out in this forest here. Going for our hike. Beautiful, beautiful forest. Liam and I live for the outdoors. That's why we love being in forest camping. It's just, get out people, get outside, see nature. I can't tell you how much we love to be out here enjoying this, enjoying a nice walk, beautiful trail, camping, camping meals, the fire, everything. We love it all. <laughs> well, we've made our way down to this creek. We're on a bridge. It's really beautiful here. We are done our hike, short and sweet, about a kilometer and a half, but it was beautiful in there. We're gonna head Great. back to the campsite, start a campfire, have some dinner. We'll see you back there soon. So back from hiking, back to the campsite, we are gonna have one of these dehydrated eat in the pouch meal. And this one is chili mac. So we're each gonna have one of these. I got my little stove here. And of course, all my pots. And I'm going to enjoy a beer as well. So let's crack this. Cheers, everybody. It's nice and cold goes down beautifully <laughs> all right so let's get this going get this out I can get it out I love these uh, woods camping products they're just fantastic use them a lot i think we're going to use we got two of them so one for myself and of course one for my son so i think i'm going to use this larger pot for water this thing comes with all these pots frying pan in here it's just amazing this thing beautiful all right so let's put that on there This thing heats up so fast, it's unbelievable. I like to keep a clean campsite. So I always, uh, you know, taking stuff out to show you guys, but I always like to keep my area nice and clean. So I always tidy up. Also with some wild camping coming up soon with my son, it's good to be safe. Cause when you're wild camping, you cannot leave food out. You cannot leave pots that aren't clean, that smell like food. You're inviting trouble in terms of animals. And uh, you just can, do not want that. You don't want animal interactions, that is for sure. Camping spoons here that, uh, these things are awesome. Voyage titanium. And it's nice and long for eating these ready wise eat in pouch meals that's why i love them so much so anyways we are going to eat very very soon all right let's check this see how we're doing here still not quite ready but this thing is fast it's unbelievable how quickly the water boils using this very very handy this is it right here and I'll show it to you. My son just informed me that I'm his crazy neighbor. Like Steve Wallace has crazy neighbor, it's crazy Liam. I meant it the other way around. <laughs>
Can I just put the spoon on the cloth? Mm -hmm. And you really got to stir these up. Looks good, but you really, really got to stir these well. Because if you don't, as I said in my last video, you're going to find pockets down here that just don't cook. So I always give it, I can see one right now. <laughs> give it a good stir and really dig into those pockets. And add, whoops, add a tiny bit more water. All right, now seal it up. Let it do its thing. I re-stir it again in about seven or eight minutes. I'm gonna relax for a little bit, letting that food cook up. My son and I are gonna eat. I'm gonna have my beer and then uh, let the camping begin. We're gonna start a fire and um, have a great evening. We're gonna try our Ready Wise That's meal. Awesome. <laughs> let's hope. Hope. Let's hope that these are good. Chili Mac. Let's try it out. I have not yet tried this one. Looks good. Looks really good. Wow. Mm, I like that. I like that. Pretty good. Nice and hot. Not bad. I think mine could use to be cooked just a tiny bit longer. Yeah, just a little longer. Well, we are just finishing up eating. It was awesome. What do you think, Leah? Great, great for camping food. Yeah, great camping food, really enjoyed it. We're going to get that fire started very very soon we just had a visit from a neighbor camper that was showing us about his gas and he heard that we like the wild camp so he uh was showing us his uh gas and his uh, cooker that he uses when he does any camping that's you know off the beaten path a little bit so it was pretty cool All right, so Liam and I are in the tent. We got, it's warm in here. We got our fan going. We got a little tent fan hooked up to the Jackery. And we're just chilling in the tent for a little bit because we haven't really checked it out too much because it's just been too hot to be in here, but it's cooled down. And we're just enjoying ourselves hanging out in the tent here. We're gonna go down to uh, the beach and enjoy the sunset soon. We are back at Lake Erie for the sunset, which is really, really beautiful. We're looking forward to seeing it. So I'm going to start the fire tonight using the pull start fire, which I saw Steve Wallace use and I've used it a few times and it's great, really great. So I'm going to use that. All right, so there it is, that little white box in there. We're ready to go. You pull this red string, it's attached to a, um, there's a little green string, you see, you put it around a log, then you pull it. So check this out, it's really fun.
we've got this fire burning nice looks fantastic beautiful man that pull start fire i've used it about four or five times now camping it's amazing it works every time yeah works every time what do you think liam it looks amazing man it's, it's huge yeah it works every time i highly recommend that thanks again steve wallace <laughs> Well, we are enjoying this fire. It's really awesome. It's getting dark now. We are going to make some s'mores. That's a lot of fun when you're camping, so we're gonna have some s'mores. The temperature has dropped dramatically and it's cooling off. It's gonna be cool overnight, so uh, we're gonna be bundled up in our sleeping bags, but already starting to see my breath. That's how cold it's getting out here. So we're gonna stay warm by the fire for now and then we're gonna have some s'mores and uh, probably be hitting the sack soon. So we're having our s'mores now. What's camping without s'mores? Enjoy. Awesome, Liam. Well, it is beautiful out here tonight. It's a little bit chilly, but not too bad. Fire's going. It's about 10 o'clock. We're going to hit the sack soon. I'm an early riser. Tomorrow's his day to sleep in. <laughs> But I'm always up early, so we're gonna hit the sack soon. Keep in mind. Okay. The tent almost ready to go. Put a lantern in it, and it looks amazing. We are in the tent settling down for the night it's actually it's cool outside it's actually quite a bit warmer in here we are both quite surprised at how much warmth this tent retains even though it's this is all basically open but it's covered as you could see from the earlier shots outside but uh, it does have airflow you can definitely feel air but it's warm so we're going to sleep well in here. We're not going to be too cold, I don't think. So we are going to get set up to go to sleep. So we will see everybody in the morning. Good morning. I have to be quiet because I'm one of the very first up around this camping area here. I'm an early riser, as I mentioned. So just making my coffee, getting my morning started. It was a rough night. It was really loud. <laughs> Birds were really loud, like the loons, and then some lunatics around the uh, campsite, screaming and yelling, playing music loud. The warden had to come and tell them to turn off their music. It was a bit of a crazy night. Some guy singing country music that shouldn't be singing country music. <laughs> Terrible singing and guitar playing. <laughs> I work professionally as a musician, so I can tell you, it was bad. <laughs> so now I'm just gonna have my coffee and uh, relax for a little bit.
By the way, this is coffee. It's like a tea bag, but it's coffee. And uh, this is one of the ways I use coffee at camp. It's easy. It's expensive though. I'm thinking I'm gonna go back to uh, filtering it, but this is fine for now. This shouldn't take long. Looks like we got some boiling water here. Let's put that over there for a moment and let this steep. Actually, that is perfect to keep it warm. What a great little cup this is, I love it. We'll just let that steep for a little bit. I'll put some milk in it and uh, enjoy our coffee. Nice hot coffee. Oh, it's really hot. So, got an interesting breakfast lined up here. Eggs, peppers, onions, cheese, making an omelet. So I got two stoves I'm going to be using for this actually to cook up different parts.
Unfortunately, I forgot to bring plates. <laughs> so we're eating out of the pots in the frying pan. That's okay, no big deal. We're campers, that's what we do. Yeah. Well, Liam and I have our breakfast, onions, peppers, cheese, eggs, camping breakfast. We're gonna enjoy our breakfast. I'm still drinking that coffee. We're gonna have, we're having a great morning. Let's see how this is. Good. Just needs a little salt and pepper. Other than that, excellent. Liam and I are just finishing up breakfast and uh, we're gonna go down, back down to the beach area and hang out down there because it's nice and quiet and it's beautiful down there. So that's what our plan is for the morning. I've already cleaned up somewhat and then I'm gonna come back and finish cleaning up and uh, we're just gonna have a little bit of a relaxing morning to mid morning and then it's teardown time and we're out of here. Well, Liam and I are just finishing up our camp at Selkirk. We had a great time. The beach was amazing. We loved it down there. We saw some really cool animals down there. We enjoyed sitting out on the sandy beaches down there. Some parts of it were rocky. Some parts of it were nice and sandy, but uh, we've been sitting at our campsite here talking. I'm telling stories to Liam about the old days of when I used to work, <laughs> work a job. Anyways, we are uh, going to start tearing down here very soon and uh, sadly we have to head back and get back to the grind. So um, tear down is going to start now. Actually, give it a shake this way for a second. do this.
All right, so that wraps up the camp. We're all finished camping and we're all finished at the beach and now the drive home. Thanks very much for tuning in. This is only my second camping video. Check out my other channel, uh, Tim Connolly Drums. Uh, that is my main channel and I've had that channel for a long time as I'm a professional drummer and uh, that is my drumming YouTube channel. This is my hobby camping YouTube channel. So thank you very much. Like, subscribe, comment, and we'll see you soon. Keep camping. See ya.